All right, let's check out and see what we got from Tavor this time. Let's, I have no clue what's in here at all. Ooh, fun stuff right off the bat. Black Project, great sours out of Denver. Let's see, this one is Kipper, sour ale with pineapple and pomegranate. That's fun, all right. And Anchorage Brewing Company, Pie Assassin. What is this guy? An IPA, 6.4 ABV. So maybe some lemony, maybe citrusy kind of IPA. Kind of deviates from their standard can art. They've got, uh, or they've got something kind of gothic on it. Oh my gosh, what is this? I don't even know where to begin with this. Why are cakes round and other pastry mysteries? Um, I don't even know what this is. From Broward West, 15 ABV, whatever this is. An Imperial Stout, there we go. With chocolate, hazelnut, uh, hazelnut spread, candy syrup, bananas, and vanilla cookies. That is interesting, so someone should win there. What else do we have in our pantry? All this stuff, we'll throw it in there. We got here of palm celix here. That's a mead with pomegranate flavors. A pecan pie pastry stout. Oh, that should be fun. I liked all their other stuff. Had some of their sours and stouts. What is this guy? Juan de Bolas. Imperial stout conditioned on Jamaican blue mountain coffee, blueberry, coconut nib, co cocoa nibs, and coconut. 15 ABV. All right. Interesting. A blueberry -ish stout. That'll be fun. like a super huge box, but I think that's supposed to be Veruca salt, maybe, or I don't know. Wouldn't make sense, but yeah, I mean, I've been doing a lot of, I don't know, she's a little weird, but German chocolate cake stout. Is it just me or does that look like Veruca salt? Or... All right, Barter Brewing Co. Kickin' Knowledge Milkshake IPA, brewed with vanilla, coconut, lactose, sea salt, caramel. That should be fun. Good times. Alright. Like Toy Story themed thing. You're a way to go, Idaho. Hazy double IPA. Go from Idaho, or it's got Idaho hops. I don't know. That's pretty fun. And Olaphant Brewing, Honeys, Honeys, a peanut butter and honey golden ale with this, that thing. Whatever that is. I have no clue what's going on here. Too much more here. All right, here's another one of these guys with these crazy stickers on it from Browridge. I don't know how to say that. It's Apocalypse How. Uh, let's see, what is this guy? Uh, Imperial Stout. Imperial Stout. Peanuts, vanilla, chocolate, lactose. So, chocolate peanut butter stout dude. And Mast Landing Brewing Company. Another dessert waffle inspired imperial stout with maple syrup and vanilla beans. Two more here. 
almost done with me. All right, here's another Anchorage with their kind of traditional kind of gothic looking can art here together again. I don't know if I've had this one before. Double IPA, DDH, double dry hop. This guy looks fun. Revolution Brewing, Death by Cherries, an Imperial Stout. Imagine he's pretty heavy on cherries there. here. The Droid Theory, all that I have learned. A Russian Imperial Stout aged in maple whiskey barrels. That'd be fun. It's very, very stout heavy here. And Darkest Hour, Imperial Stout, aged one year in Woodford Reserve, double oak barrels, brewed with all sorts of stuff. Anyhow, yeah, it's got that and it's got this green wax on it too that's a handsome looking bottle there and that let me do it that is all that's our haul from today there we go thanks for joining me